Well, first of all, I just want to say thank you for last week's upload. It did really, really well. Lots of people watched it, so really appreciate it. So today we're doing two Hondas. So the first one is this Honda Beat from 1991. Can push over 8,000 RPM. It's another K car, which was popular in Japan. And Honda was famous for being at the forefront of these vehicles. So it's a tiny little vehicle. A cool little cabriolet. A midship runabout. Mid-engined car. So uh, where are we going to be in this with its 63 brake horsepower? I don't know, folks. Uh, we're looking around the cappuccino time, let's be honest. So if it can get anywhere near that cappuccino with a 218.2, then we've done okay. So uh, let's run the lap. So as you can see, I did a 218.255 at the end of lap two. And it's a question of can we beat it in lap three. And as you can see, I had some massive sideways drift going on there at the start of the lap. Um, which completely ruined lap two, and it's probably looking like it's going to ruin lap three. But obviously, I will show you the quickest lap. So uh, let, let it run, guys, and then uh, I'll tell you at the end my thoughts. As you can see, I managed to come back at the end there because I had a sloppy middle sector. Uh, nailed that last corner beautifully. And uh, probably just lost a little bit of time there, actually. But we are going to be a 218. And we actually get a 217.8. So, yeah, pretty happy with that lap time. It, uh, it, was, uh, it was quite fun. It was quite a fun car. So uh, I'll just let the lap run and you can just watch the replay before we move on to car number two.
So yeah, we uh, we know where we're going to be with this car, don't we? Um, we'll look at the right PP setting might actually help. Uh, we're down there, twentieth and last. So we did two seventeen eight though. So uh, not bad, not bad really. Weren't that far off the um, Mazda two touring. So yeah. Right, guys, uh, let's get on to car number two, which is the Honda S660 from 2015. So it's another MR drivetrain car with a 658cc engine. So again, it's another K car. Okay, so um, let's just check the interior and exterior of the car out on this one. It's very modern, as you can see. Well, it is a modern car at the end of the day. I like the digital dashboard layout on this car, I've got to say. Um, it's a very impressive little car. But will it be fast? That is the question. It, I mean, it's got to be faster than the uh, Beat 91, surely. But um, how much faster, I don't know. So, uh, yeah, we'll get to, on to the lap now. And we can see how it does. So realistically, where are we looking to be here in the PP400s? Uh, around the Aqua time, I'd say, a 212 or a Honda Fit. We've got, we've got to be in that region. So, um, right, we're straight on to lap three. I did a 214.3 on the first lap and a 214.9 on the second lap. Oh, we'll try and beat you. As you can see, I made a right mess on lap one, but actually gained the time by the looks of it. But, um, so yeah, I made a mistake there in lap one, which uh, actually looked like a gain time through that. But uh, we'll see now uh, if I can, well, I will catch up slightly, because this is obviously the fastest lap, otherwise I wouldn't be showing it here. And let's see how we take this turn, which is actually not too bad too bad at all I know you folks really want me to get onto the big fast cars um, and it will be coming guys and girls but I've got to I've got to get through some of these um, the smaller cars because I do I do enjoy driving them so and probably not many people drive them they come onto the game and, and they go for the the fastest running cars and uh, yeah I like to have a go at all these little cars and see how we do so yeah um, that's why we're doing these. Uh, it's going to be a bit different in next week's episode. Uh, we've got an 80s classic coming in eight in next week's episode. So there we go, I smashed it with a 2.13.7. So I'll let the uh, replay run as usual, I'll let you enjoy that.
Okay, let's have a look at the times then. Where do we fit? Ah, oh, so we are behind the Honda Fit and the Aqua. So it wasn't as quick. It was, but it was quicker than the Arbath from last week, if you remember. The Autobachi A112 Arbath 85. It was quicker than that. So that's it, everyone. I hope you enjoyed this week's episode. Uh, like I say, massively appreciate last week's support. And if you're new here, please subscribe to the channel. It would really, really help me a lot. I'm trying my best to increase my subscriber numbers. So thank you, everyone. And see you next week. Bye.